19th pick in 88, drafted by the Knicks, drafted to the Knicks, Danny Manning, Rick Smith, Smith Richmond, Dan Marley, my guy. <laughs> that was a nice class. Talk about that year. Yeah, it was a decent class. Uh, no, I mean, I got drafted by the Knicks. Home team. Home team, but I wasn't excited. Yeah, yep. Mark. And I didn't know, like, I was told I was going to go somewhere between 7 and 15. And the Seattle Supersonics told my agent that if I was at 15, they were taking me. So, you know, I was nervous because my, my high, uh, college coach, Joey Meyer, called me and told me I was dropping in draft. So I think it was Boston and the Lakers. They always had the last two picks. So I, one of them called them. And so I'm like nervous because, you know, you get to that point, you could slip to the second mm -hmm. round. I never expected the Knicks to draft me. And then uh, they drafted, uh, uh, you know, they had Mark from the prior year. So I'm thinking, I'm looking at the board. And I'm like, I'm going late. Uh, so when they picked me, I was surprised. And I got booed like in New York, which is crazy to me. Not to cut you off, did Mark say he was mad they drafted him? We had Mark on the show, did he? Didn't he say he was, was he? Confused? Yeah, he didn't, he didn't like that. Yeah, he wasn't fucking with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, He wouldn't say that back then. Yeah. Mark is my guy, yeah, yeah, yeah. but yeah, I, I wouldn't I wouldn't right. like that. Right, right, You know right. what I mean? I'm, I'm a rookie and, and he you had go just draft. won rookie of the year too, didn't yeah. he? Yeah. Dang. But I wish it was too early for that time. Like they would put me and Mark in yeah, the game. Yeah. They would put us in the game at times and we would turn the guard out. You know, but at that time, two point guards, they weren't doing that. They weren't ready for that. I wish we could have done that more because uh, we would have been really good. But that was a clash. Like, that was hard, right? And me and Mark always held respect for each other. And Mark could tell you this. I tried to fight Mark one day in practice. <laughs> <laughs> we talk about it. We laugh about it all the time. <laughs> like, I was mad one day. I just was frustrated. And every time he tried to come off the ball screen, I was just hitting him. Mm -hmm. Like, I just was, you know, but we talk about it all the time. But Mark is my guy. I got utmost respect for him. And what he did was he was professional. Yeah. And I struggled with that, right? So that was kind of the difference, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. But I like Mark, 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 the way he carried himself. Uh, you know, Mark has the ability to make everyone think they're better than they are. You know what I mean? Yeah, it like, look like that. Yeah, and you, you see what he did as a coach with Golden State, but he also did that as a player. Mm -hmm. So I got like the utmost for my guy. Yeah. Didn't, didn't the Knicks like try like two point guards again before that with like Tiny Archibald? Who was fire and ice? No, you talking about uh, Frazier and Pearl, Frazier Pearl and Monroe? Pearl. So they, yeah, they didn't try. They did. That was they it. Did. That, that was work. it. Yeah, yeah, they won yeah. a championship. Like that was yeah, that, that was the deal. That won't work. <laughs> yeah. so, but but did they keep trying to repeat that? Like a year. No, after they year? didn't. They they wouldn't. Uh, they didn't know. That was it. Like that was a, you know, like an outlier. That was just different. Yeah. yeah okay. You know? And I think Clive was about six four. Clive Frazier was I think yeah. I think he was somewhere around there, which makes it a little different. Mm -hmm. You know what right, I mean? Because it's not, not too small six guard. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, it made yeah. it a little different. It's, it's, it's a legit point guard and shooting guard. Yeah, it made it a little different. Yeah.